from the top of a seven meter high building. So we are given a building whose height is seven meter. So let me mark it. A B and B building it's making 90 degrees with the ground. Now please be careful. It says the angle of elevation of the top of the cable tower is 60 degree. We are saying from the top of the building, the angle of elevation of the cable tower. That means the tower is higher than building or what? You are standing at the top of the building and you are looking at the top of the cable tower and you are making angle of elevation. So what does it mean? The tower is tower is Taller than, than the building. Then you have angle of elevation. So let yes. it be CD. So from A you are making angle of elevation. Now since you are making angle of elevation, you need to first make what? What do you need? Normal line. Normal. Of line. So let this be a normal line of sight. Let us call it P. So this angle is 60 degrees. All right. Yes, ma'am. Find the angle of depression of its foot. Angle of depression of its foot. Its foot means foot of the tar from where? Angle A only. Can you better? Up yes. angle A is downwards they cream of the foot pe. from point A when you are looking at the foot of the tar the angle of depression is made and this was the normal line of sight children please understand this is the depressed way so this has to be normal this has to be angle of depression and as it says these two lines are parallel so this angle will also be Yes, children. We have to find the height of the tar. Are you with me? Yes, yes ma'am. Ma yes, ma'am. We are given a seven meter tall building. From the top of the building, the angle of elevation of cable tar is 60 degrees. Since we are talking of angle of elevation, that itself says that tower is taller than the building. Right? Now from the same point, the angle of depression of its foot is 45. As we know, the angle of depression first has to be marked this. And alternate angles are equal, so this will also be 45 degrees. Here, beta, we have to find the height of the tower. Can we do this? Can we do this? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma right now, in this right triangle, with the help of perpendicular, can we calculate BD? Yes, ma'am. What it should be according to you? Sin 45. Sin 45. Sin 45 is for uh, one? 7 meter. 7 meter. Seven meter. Seven meter. Very good. Now, A, A, P, B, 7. A, P, D, B. Will P, D also be 7 meter? Yes, ma'am. And what about A, P? 7. Yeah. So next, we are going to take this triangle. In this triangle, P, C is unknown. PC upon 7 is tan 60. Can we please calculate the value of PC? Yes, ma'am. After calculating PC, we shall add 7 meter to that to get the total height of the cable tar. Yes? 7 root 3 plus 7. Whatever it will come out to be. Yes, children? Ma'am, how BD7? Yes, ma'am. Which one? Yes, ma'am. BD, you are asking? Ma'am, BD, you are asking? 
एसकेटी कौन सी क्लास है तेरी आई न्यूटेड योर सेल्फ तो ना पतो राइट नाउ हियर वी नीड टू मेंशन बोथ द एंगल्स एज वी आर टॉकिंग ऑफ एंगल ऑफ डिप्रेशन ठीक है फाइन yes children so first we have taken right triangle abd next in right triangle apc do we have pc upon ap is equal to 60 degree tan 60 degree yes ma'am which means now this ap is 7 meter why from the figure you can see ap is equal to bd and thus it gives me pc is equal to 7 root 3 meter cross multiply Right. Seven root three plus seven. Now, ah, my baby, eight. Height of cable tower. Is equal to CD, which is equal to CP plus PD. Seven root three plus seven meter. Unit is much to write. Now from here you can take seven common meter. Put the value of root three. One point seven three plus one, which is seven into two point seven three meter. Anybody can multiply and let. Let us know. Nineteen point one one meter. Ninety. Priyansh, 